Hi and welcome back to my channel. My name is Lakwe Shweta. I'm a relationship coach for single women over the age of 30. I help single women over the age of 30 attract and keep the right relationship. To attract the right man for you, you have to understand men as a whole. And that can be very difficult because men and women are different, really very different. Which is why it's difficult for one sex to understand the other. And that's why I'm here today. I'm going to be trying to explain one aspect of men's behavior. Today I'm going to be talking about what to do when he pulls away. Before we talk about what to do when a man pulls away, we have to realize that a man pulling away can vary depending on the status of the relationship with you. For example, if a man is just dating you and he pulls away, it might be for a different reason than if a man is in a committed relationship with you or if he is married to you and he pulls away. So seeing that there are two different situations in which a man might be pulling away, the reasons for that might be different. So your reactions to what he does when he pulls away should be different as well. These are two different situations. I'll go into both situations now. If you've been dating a guy and he suddenly starts acting strange, perhaps he stops taking your calls, he starts replying your text messages sparingly, and then after a while he even stops replying your text messages, you can see that he has been acting differently. This is completely different from how he was in the beginning. So what should you do? The first thing you need to do is to talk to him. Ask him what is up. Let him know that you can see that he's acting differently from he, the way he was at the beginning. Give him examples. Then ask him the reason for his behavior. Don't scream and shout. There's no need for drama. Just talk to him and ask him. If he's not taking your calls, send him a message saying these things. He may admit that he's acting differently and he may tell you the reason why or he may not. After you talk to him, he may start behaving like the way he was behaving at the beginning he must start being nice and responsive and communicative again or he may not really cannot determine how the guy will react he could also show interest again in the relationship and then start acting up once again your reaction if he shows interest again in the relationship is to go on with the relationship if you are interested in it don't feel under pressure to do anything that you don't want to do though but give the relationship a chance if he has shown that he wants to be in a relationship again if, on the other hand, he still shows no interest in becoming the great guy he was at the beginning, or even after you asked him what's wrong and he just doesn't change, realize that he's trying to tell you that he's not interested in taking a relationship further, he's not interested in getting to know you better, it might be time for you to move on. Also, if you ask him what is wrong and he tries to blame you, don't immediately take whatever he says straight to heart. Ask yourself if there's any truth in what he has said. Ask yourself if there's a way you can make yourself better, not necessarily for him, but because you will be a better person. You are doing this for you. But remember that you are you. You will be happiest when you are yourself. Don't change yourself just to please someone else. Now let's get into the second situation. If you're in a committed relationship or a marriage and the man starts pulling away, talk to him about it. Like I said earlier, this is not the time to scream and shout. Just speak to him clearly. Let him know that he is acting different and ask him why he is behaving differently. If he tells you it's nothing, let the situation go. Everybody needs some space sometimes, particularly men. So if he pulls away and says nothing is the problem, just let him be. He'll probably come back again to you soon. If you think you have given him enough time and he still hasn't come back, he's still pulled away, then bring up the topic with him again. If you ask him what is wrong and he's talking to you, listen and try to help. Trying to help doesn't always mean that you should take some action. Sometimes the best action you can take in this kind of situation is just to listen. If you want to do more than just listen, ask him how you can help him and then proceed to do what it is that he has asked you for. As long as, of course, it's not anything immoral, unethical or illegal. Just ask him how you can help him and then take steps to help him in that way. If you're in a committed relationship or a marriage and your man pulls away, you've taken steps to rectify the situation but nothing is working, this might be time for you to consider coaching. Talk to your man and let him know that you think that both of you should get coaching. If he absolutely refuses to get coaching with you, you go for coaching alone. Even if you go for coaching by yourself, it can greatly improve the situation of your relationship. Many people don't know that. I hope you found these tips useful. If you want more tips like this from me on a daily basis, follow me on Instagram. I've written a lot of ebooks for single women over the age of 30 on a variety of topics that have to do with love and relationships. If you want to get my free ebooks, go to www.billy.com forward slash love tips. I hope you enjoyed this video once again. 
If you did, please give it a thumbs up below, share it with your friends, and also subscribe to my YouTube channel. You can subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking on the red subscribe button you'll see down below, or by clicking on my picture that you'll see somewhere on the screen. After you subscribe, remember to click on the bell that you'll see there so that you'll be notified as soon as a new video of mine comes out. I wish you love and strength. Mwah.